pleased you most? Um, yeah, well, I thought both teams had a really high pressure level, and I thought uh, after quarter one in particular, I thought we really elevated in that area. So that was probably the, the standout. Um, and then obviously defensively, you know, we were really solid. Uh, yeah, really strong work rate from, from everyone to allow us to sort of hold some really good shape. What sort of work rate did you, your defenders need? It seemed like you, you just had extra players at, at every contest. Yeah, so it relies, it relies on the whole of team, obviously, to, to generate that. It's not just our defenders, but clearly our defenders were really, um, yeah, really impressive. Won a lot of one-on-one -on -one contests and uh, even obviously Freo kicked six points, but you know a lot of time that was you know, really high pressure from our from our defenders. So uh, yeah, really pleased. How about you, your midfielders and Hatcher in particular in her game? What, what did you like about that? Yeah, no, well they're amazingly consistent and and have been for a long period of time. So um, I guess it, in some ways we sort of just come to expect it, which is probably a little unfair, but. Uh, yeah, no, clearly uh, both, uh, both Anne and Ebony had a heap of it uh, through work rate. Um, Maddie Newman got a, got a lot of the ball once again through really high work rate. Uh, but I thought also some of our newer uh, midfielders who probably the possession rate may, may not have been quite as high, but I felt like the general pressure that they were brought was really, really a good level. Just to, to nitpick on one thing, did you feel like you, you took full... I guess, toll on the scoreboard? Yeah, no, we probably left, uh, once again, last week we were a bit the same. We, we missed some opportunities, um, you know, but I, I think Frio's pressure was at a really high level, so ultimately, you know, you can't get too concerned about that. But, yeah, clearly we'd like to be a little more efficient um, and obviously be a little more accurate. And you talk about your pressure, how nice is it to have someone out of like Ebony who just tackles through a machine and when you're that far ahead on the scoreboard, I think she had 18 today and 13. Yeah, right. Yeah, well, that's a big number. <laughs> um, yeah, no, that's... I mean, she, she builds her game off of that. Uh, she's always working constantly on every other element of her game as well, but but that's what she comes back to, yeah, that defensive pressure. And But I'd say, obviously, that's a standout figure, but uh, across the board, everyone everyone did their bit in that in that regard today. And for the first few minutes, they're pretty short to lose their kick mark a little bit, but you guys yeah. break down pretty quickly and get them to play a game that they want to play. How impressive with that? Yeah, no, they possessed possessed the ball a bit early and, and were you know causing us a few issues um, and then in late in the game they started to you know create some overlap and Ash Brazel coming out of the back, back line was looking dangerous with some overlap run but um, once again overall you know defensively it was a, it was a good day for us. How much confidence do you take out of this result now going forward you've obviously been playing around the season but still a start to win your first round game? Oh, 100% you know as we all are really aware the AFLW season is short so you have to get out of the blocks and you have to try and you know, bank a few wins early, so to get uh, two and two off the st out of the start line is uh, yeah, great for us. We're, we're wrapped, absolutely. Hawthorne look like they're in pretty good nick. How do you feel going into to that game? Yeah, so obviously we've never played Hawthorne, so all oh, that fell over. Um, <laughs> so we've never played Hawthorne before, but yeah, watching their first two games, they're they're playing super football. It's exciting and you know really high speed uh, attacking style of footy. So. Uh, that's the type of game we'd love to be part of. So, uh, yeah, next Sunday we play them. It'll be our first home game, so it'll be a great opportunity for our fans to get along and uh, hopefully enjoy a really good game of footy. All good? Thanks, Thanks guys. Thanks.